course, I understand that nomination issue as well as any member of the Senate. The Senate Judiciary Committee has been working overtime to report nominees to the calendar, and I understand the challenges that Senator Schumer faces. But the fact of the matter is, those that we don't finish this year, many of them will probably be returned to the committee. Historically, we've had an agreement with both parties to keep some on the calendar. We haven't reached it this time. We'll be back at square one with many of these nominees, not for a hearing, but for an actual vote before the committee. It just means further delays. And you have to ask yourself, for what purpose? We've already gone through the entire process on these nominees, and the votes have been taken. We have a matter of record. It is clearly an effort by some on the Republican side to stop the Biden administration from filling vacancies they need on the executive branch and on the judicial branch. I'm discouraged by what's happening with nominations, but I'm certainly encouraged by what we're apparently getting ready to do on debt ceiling. Senator Schumer said, this is integral to the economy and time is wasting. Uh, we are hoping that we can get this done as soon as tomorrow and move forward. Then we should move to build back better. I just want to make one note, a uh, historic note that I mentioned on the floor this morning. This year is the 100th anniversary of the discovery of insulin. It was uh, 100 years ago when a Canadian researcher discovered it and started saving lives of those who were facing diabetes. Today, over 8 million Americans have diabetes. Many of them are facing costs of insulin, which are prohibitive. They literally hardly can afford the money for these life-saving drugs. One of the elements in this Build Back Better is to help families pay for the insulin for their diabetic loved one. How basic is that? And when Senator McConnell comes to the floor and says, we can't raise taxes on the rich, I say to save the lives of those who suffer from diabetes, yes, we can, and we should. And that's just one of the elements, one of the many elements that's part of it. Senator Murray will tell you about more. Senator Murray.